This is a video to show you how to access Teams, um, how to see general posts, access the assignments and hand in work from home. So the first thing you need to do is type in Office 365 into Google and it will be in office.com, the first link you can see. When you click it, it will say welcome to Office. You will click sign in. On the sign in page, you need to enter the email address for your child that has been given to you by a teacher. It is the school email, not your own email. So if you do not have an email given to you by a teacher for your child at Atlas, you need to make sure that you ask the class teacher for that. You'll also be prompted for a password. Again, you must get this password from your class teacher to access. Once you have inputted your email address and your password given to you by school, this page will load up. So if you look on the left hand side, you can see some icons. There is a Word document, Excel, PowerPoint, and if you go down here where there's some blue silhouettes of people, this is the Teams section. This is the section that you need to click on to. Once Teams loads, um, this is what it will look like for you for the first time you um, log on. And if you look here, there is even some extra guidance for you um, of how to turn in assignments, and join things so feel free to use that guidance there. What you need to do next is you need to join your team that your class teacher will have set up. So this is the year six um, team so you're going to click into that and I'll show you what to do next. When you click onto your team group this is what will you, you will be looking at. So Atlas Year 6 2020 here and this is your general posts here. This is where you might have conversations, you might have replies from your teacher and it's where your assignments will also come up. So to do an assignment there's two options here. You can click view assignment here or you can go to assignment at the top and find it through there as well. When you click on assignments, this is what you will get. So you'll get some dates, when they are due, um, and then you need to click into those assignments and I will show you how to hand in your work. This is what it will look like. So you'll be given some instructions um, and you'll be given some work attached to it. So there are two documents here attached. There is one point possible. So you need to have a go doing this work. So you need to click the document in order to complete it. In the assignment, once you have selected what you need to do, so you need to have a look at the files that are underneath and there's three dots next to it. So um, if you click on the three dots there, there's a few options of what you can do. So if you're using a computer that you are able to access Word documents because you have Word on your computer, you can click download. If not, you can do it in the browser. So you click download and get the learning up. It will download and open and then you'll have the work in front of you. Um, in year six, we are asking for a table um, to be filled in. Um, because you have the paper packs to do your work on. So this is an overview of how your lesson is doing. So if you type into it and just edit everything, so this is what your teacher will be looking at. So just type into the document and you might just tell me uh, the reading score, you'll be given what it's out of. Did you complete the writing? Yes. What was your math score? Did you complete the topic work? Yes. And any comments you want to put in could be typed in there. And I can just type into it normally like that. Then you need to go to File and Save As. You will need to save your work somewhere where you can remember. And I recommend you call your work your name. So you're typing your name here. So I have just used my initials here, and then I'm going to click Save. And then going to come back to the assignment page where you viewed your work, where you downloaded it from, and you're going to click on the paperclip here that says add work. 
you then need to select upload from this device because you have saved it to your computer then you need to find your file that you've got the date and you've put your name on click it and click open bar will go across here to green and once it's loaded you can click done this has now been added to the work that you will be submitting now you go to the top right corner and you click hand in you will get a message showing you that it has been handed in at that date and at that time and a little tick your teacher will then look at your work, look at the table feedback you have filled in and then will give you some feedback about your work and give you any points if you have earned them. When you receive feedback from your teacher, it will show up on your activity bell and um, it will show up, you'll get a notification. If you click on that, you can then click on the feedback you have been given. I hope this video helps. Um, so, yeah, I hope you can use Teams using this. Good luck.